Hey, y'all. It's vortex time. Let's do a little chicken. Come on. We've got ourselves a Heritage Farms chicken, whole chicken from Smith's. Uh, Kroger brand uh, kind of stuff, but uh, only cost us five bucks for an almost six pound chicken. Not bad. What we're gonna do here, we'll just take and slice this open, drain the juice, I'm not dripping everywhere, drain as much as we can out of it. You can hear the kids in the background screaming. Free range kids, free range chickens, free range kids. Okay, I'm gonna get any, let's see, we've got some giblets, we've got the neck. What we're gonna do, is I'm gonna put my fingers up underneath the skin to the breast. And I wanna create a cavity, because I actually wanna put some seasoning, oops, I just ripped it a little. I wanna put some seasoning under there, too. Money maker, it's all we pretty much ever use. We use everything else too, but very little. We use Moneymaker on, I mean, literally everything, y'all. It's that good. So we'll sprinkle a little in there. And we're just gonna go to spread it out inside. Like so, simple. Don't wanna put a ton, just enough for that flavor to seep down in. Now we're gonna go and shake this whole thing down. Don't forget the most important part, season the cavity. Bring that skin back down to cover up the bottom of the breast. We'll let that sit. Actually, let's get a little bit more on top. We'll let that sit for just a few minutes while we get the countertop cleaned up here. Oh yeah. Oh, it's frothy too. Oh yeah. All right, excuse me, that was, whew, that's refreshing. Hey, we've got our Instant Vortex Plus set here. And right now, currently it's off, so we're gonna go ahead and set it to roast. We're gonna turn it up to, oh, let's say about 375. 375, we're gonna come over here and hit, um, 40 minutes and it will notify us to flip uh, about halfway through. So that's ready to go. All we have to do is press start. So we're gonna press start and it's gonna heat up. And it's gonna let us know here in, oh, 30 seconds to a minute that we need to put in the meat. It will say add food. In the meantime, we're gonna go ahead and toss this bird. Now normally, I like to marinate, dry marinate, overnight but in life we don't always have that option so we're going to test this instant vortex and see if it can infuse those flavors just with a 10 minute soap time quick dinner so we're going to go ahead and put this 5.7 pound bird right on here just like that don't forget to always beat your meat like it owes you money all right, so we've got the add food thing and it's beeping at us. So we're gonna go ahead and pop this open. Let's heat it up to 375. We're gonna take this beautiful little 5.7 pound bird and toss this right down here on the bottom. Actually, you know what? You know, I could get away with putting it on the middle rack. Oh yeah. Oh, nope, nope, maybe not. <laughs> it's hitting the rotisserie uh, parts. So we're gonna let her go for about uh, 40 minutes and See you then. All right, it's on its cool down time. Now, we're not necessarily done and out of the woods yet. First, we're gonna go ahead and take an instant read uh, temperature. This is the Haviland Pro. I've had it for, I can't even tell you how many years. It's a great little thermometer. So we got another 20 or so, 15 to 20 degrees to go. So what we're gonna do, and I thought of this kind of in the moment, 
uh, but I want to rotate the chicken because the heating element on the Instant Vortex Plus is only on the top. So I want to get that bottom side crispy too. We're going to go ahead, let me pull out a plate here. Pull this out, put it on a plate. And we're just going to go ahead and flip this entire bird over. Look at that, the skin's not crispy at all. It's still kind of gelatinous. Uh, it's, it's that slimy chicken skin. So I want to get that whole bird crispy, crispy, crispy. So we're going to go ahead and toss that back in. We'll do another 15, let's go 15 minutes on it. Roast, 375, and we'll knock it down to about 20, let's do 15 minutes. And we'll be back. I think it's time for a beer break. Oh yeah. All right, y'all. Time is up. Look at what we've got there. Beautiful, crispy, crispy skin. Still popping. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and put this over right here on the plate. And check internal temperature. Yep, so we've got uh, six more degrees to go. So we're gonna go ahead and put this chicken right back on. And do it for about 10 more minutes. It's looking so juicy though. I mean, it's, it's seriously just juicing out. So let's toss it back on here. All right, so we're gonna toss it back in. Roast, we're gonna turn rotate off because we realized the rotisserie spit was spinning the entire time. And we're gonna toss it in for 10 minutes. Let's just go for it. It's not gonna be dry. It has been just the moistest little bird we've seen yet. So let's go ahead and get her started. All right, I can't wait, y'all. Look at all that grease. And the whole bottom tray is filled clear up. With Greek, it's probably run over. We're gonna go ahead and foil tent this. Let it sit for about 15 minutes and rest. Okay, we're gonna just loosely foil that. Let it sit for 10 to 15 minutes. And through the miracle of time, it's rested. It's not, it's not crispy skin anymore. Some of it is. All right, who's ready to slice into the bad mama jamma? Let's get a breast out, because the breast is always what everybody's like, oh, it's so dry. Can anybody see that? See how juicy that is? It's hot, it's hot, but you know what? We're going with it anyway. Chicken in the instant vortex. Oh my. So juicy, so tender, so flavorful. Just that little bit of uh, money maker that we put underneath the skin, you can taste it throughout the entire breast. It is seriously, I mean, come back to this right here. It's just, it's juicy. It's juicy, y'all. Seriously. It is not dry one bit. I would put this up against any any rotisserie that you buy from the grocery store, your local market, any day. Ten minutes. That's all it had to marinate. So, once again, sorry, free range kids. Hold on, buddy. Hold on. I'll be right there, okay? Once again, drunken butcher, money maker, meat rub. 
it's out of this world. It's on a level of its own. Try it. Try our version of rotisserie or roasted chicken. It's not gonna disappoint.